Hi, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And we are doing Mystery Trackers Raincliff, the bonus content, because we finished the game last time. And I've got no idea what the bonus content could be. When we left, and she's off punk. When we left the game, we escaped with an invisible person, and I think one of her brothers, who was also an invisible person, was dead, and one of the brothers was still alive and looked confused. And there was a tiger that was asleep in a bedroom. So, you think they're both alive? Well, one of them was unconscious anyway. So, I'm not sure what the bonus content is going to be. I'm going to bet it's probably how they became invisible or something like that. I don't think we're going to do future stuff, but it's always hard to say. So let's see what we got real quick before we start. Wallpapers. Oh, this is interesting. I wonder if we're going to go and do stuff in the spring now or something. Some pretty good wallpapers, comparatively. Phantoms of Raincliff. Very weird. Yeah, this is the invisible people. Bonus video. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh, we have to finish the game first. So we'll do the bonus video afterwards. Knowledge test. Read the epilogue. Okay, I think we need to do that after the game stuff too. All right, so let's just do the extra game and then we'll go back and do everything else. I can't imagine this is going to take very long. Let's go. Raincliff, three hours after the students escape, the search for Mortimer Brown yields no results. Mortimer is still at large. She's dashing around the town as if looking for someone. Okay, so maybe the other brother is dead then. Um, I guess we're looking for him or are we him? Nope, we're looking for him. Um... Mortimer has been killed. Who's the headless one? Another invisible person I know nothing about? Why isn't he wearing a mask? No, now there's that that other dude's a new person. I bet it's his dad or something. Oh no. A whistle? Mortimer Brown is dead. The case of Invisibles is open again. I should figure out the motives and consequences of this murder. Why has he given me this whistle? I don't know. Do we want the sword, though? I guess that's evidence. You hindered us in our attempt to guard the monster in the cell. I follow the Headless and hope that I'll be able to stop him. Most likely he will kill me. Then you must stop him. Mortimer Brown, go to the first floor of our mansion. Okay. Now, if this is true, wouldn't Arabelle, like, tell us that? <laughs> oh my gosh, I forgot about him! Oh no. Oh, here's a whole bunch of guns. Not gonna take the guns, huh? Motorcycle starter might come in handy. Nope, not gonna take the guns. Lots of guns. Why would anyone need so much fuel and old weaponry? This is not that old. Alright, what's up here? The headless one has vanished like a ghost. He's invisible! It's not like that would be hard! But I will find him even... I don't know what that said. I have to finish reading before I commentate. Okay! Right, what did I get? I got a bike key and flower antidote? and a whistle. Flower antidote? Alright. The gates are closed again, this time with an old-fashioned lock. Why would anyone block the way to the alley? What happened there? Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. I was thinking it was an antidote for the flowers, and that was my confusion. One knocker has been unscrewed from the gates. I don't have one. No, I do not. Right. Okay, so we can't go that way. We can't go in any of these buildings. Oh, we can go back this way. Okay. Um, 
Are they just going to let us... Oh, no, okay. I can repair the statue's hand by mortaring it with cement. It could come in handy. Ha 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 ha. Okay. It doesn't appear there's anything... They're just going to let me... It would be perfect to find a stone or marble object with a shape that's close to scoop or a hand. Wood or metal would erode easily by the toxic water. Oh, I guess I need the battery. I would think that the battery would be uh, eroded too, but what do I know? Okay. Is that kitty cat? Huh. The breach in the floor is closed with grating welded to it. The welder is here, but I can't use it until I find something to protect my eyes. Yeah, that's fair. I can't take the cement bucket from the ceiling until I have a stick. Why did someone put a cement bucket on the ceiling? Okay. Now we're back here. And we're back in the kitchen. Black roses are another family secret. Okay, this is the thing that was there before. The kitchen on the second floor, yeah. I cannot reach the lever. The hole is too narrow. Okay. And that's missing a drawer pull. Um, the bathroom door is apparently not interesting. Portrait is of the old Baron. Piece of the picture frame is missing. Okay. There's one of the dudes. And not f yet finished. This was the book we read before. <laughs> He's finished now. <laughs> okay, and here's the way to the girl's bedroom. And the tiger's still asleep. Okay. I can feel that there's something under the mattress. I don't have anything sharp yet. That fragment of the frame doesn't seem to belong there. If I dissolve the glue, I'll be able to take it. Okay. This is still not overly helpful. All right. Brown's entryway. Mansion Hall. Last time I set food in here, I was nearly killed. Yes. This is a tame mouse's place. I should call it from the hole. Is that what the whistle's for? Oh, he's so cute! Um, what, what do I need to do, though? Click the floor. Yeah, I know, but why? Well, I did that wrong already. Let's try it again, shall we? Oh, I hate this game annoys me. You're a stupid mouse, and I don't like you. Oh, okay, so it's always going to go up. Can I just reset? If I'd known it was always going to go up, this would have been a lot easier. Normally, it just moves away from wherever you're clicking. There. I think it's a mousy. Aw, it's so cute! It seems that Mortimer and Dorian had a pet, a mouse who obeyed to the sound of the whistle. Oh, that probably would have helped. Okay... Iron door. Wanted. The headless one has already committed more than one murder, but his face is still unknown to all. Okay, that needs a battery. I uh, guess a ball is missing here. And we need another arrow button. Okay. I assume that's where he's supposed to be. Maybe not. There's a light right there. I toggle the light switch. is snapped off. Oh, can I use that? No. Okay. Well, that didn't help me much, did it? All right. We got the mouse. Oh, wait. We could get the thing in the kitchen. I knew that. I assume that's what this is for, anyways. 
Thank you, Mousy. You can go play now. A toggle. That's not for the drawer. Where did we need the toggle? Need a mouse. It's so cute. Bet I could use that. Is that in here? Did I need a toggle in here? No, I need battery in here. And a ball. But this isn't it, right? No, that's like an actual ball. Okay. Alright. Uh, and this needs... This is not a toggle, is it? No, this is like a, a switch switch. Oh, no, it is. Okay, never mind. Ooh, all kinds of things I could use that they're not going to let me keep. Alright, let's see. A bat and a ladybug. That's not a ladybug. There's a ladybug. And a pencil and a bulb and a magnet and a plug. I wonder what kind of plug. Is that one? Yes, okay. And a fish hook and a measuring tape, which I totally just saw. There it is. And solvent. Is this the solvent? Yeah, okay. And a handprint and nippers, which are right there. And three springs. One. Let me click on it. Thank you. One. Two. Three. And a bat. Like what kind of a bat? Probably a bat bat. Oh, there it is. All right. We found the solvent. And there's nothing else over here. And where do we need the solvent? I need to pay closer attention to what I'm doing. Oh, for this. I was right. Okay, now I've got the picture frame fragment and I can fix the thing in the living room. Nice! And that is the handle for a door. I don't need a door handle, do I? I needed a cabinet handle. That was this. Oh. Maybe that said drawer handle. I could have gotten broken glass anywhere. Like, literally. I could have broken something to get broken glass. Ah, and that's the thing for the gate to the park. Which is all the way back over here, and we still don't have fast travel. I'm hoping the next game in the series has fast travel. Okay. Oh, this promises to be irritating. Could you move slower than that, guys? No, 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 no. No, I want to go back the other way. Not you. Ugh. I mean, in all honesty, this is how fast it would go in real life. But, uh, that's not super helpful. Or any kind of useful. Ah, oh, I was close. At least with that side. My mic is fuzzing out, or am I just mumbling? I think I was just mumbling. You think it stopped. Okay. Alright, well, this is gonna stop too, so. Yay! There was a brzz. Oh, interesting. I don't know. Oh, there's the dead policeman. I guess nobody bothered to bury him. Cut this branch. Why do I need to cut a branch? Church. It's the headless dude! Get him! Why is my vision doing that? This one is very tall, strong, and dangerous. I better get a gun from the church! He just murdered someone! I need to start the motorcycle. That's in the, the church. There were so many guns. And so much ammo! It's not even like there wasn't any ammo! I should turn the cart away from the road. A trick maneuver, perhaps. Okay. Why? How do I do that? Also, why do I do that? Let's go this way. Okay, nothing here. It's strange, there's another slot underneath the main button. It's probably for the down button! Look, broken glass. 
the music is still playing. Did the headless one drag Dorian away from here with this music playing? Something is very wrong in the city. No, duh. Rucksack is locked. Uh, is this the key for this? Yes. All right, let's see. We need a bird, which is in the water bottle for some reason. And a hat. Hat. And a pin, which I just saw. Dag damn it. Where is it? It's a bagel. Bagels are delicious. A wristwatch. Oh, there's a pin. There's a wristwatch. Two leaves. One. Two. Pliers, which I could probably use. Those are not pliers. Those are pincers. A dragonfly. Actually, three dragonflies. One. Two. Three. Lips. That's lipstick, but I guess. A tube. Uh, tube, tube? Yes. Three elephants. I don't see any elephants. Oh, there's one. Elephant. Is that an elephant? Oh, it's a elephant origami. And one more elephant. Where is him? And a pen. That's a pen cap. And a bandage, which is over here. An elephant and a pen. Why don't I see? Oh, there's the pen. The cap should be on it. Where's the other elephant? I don't see him. Hmm. Where is it? Oh, wow. I would not have found that. I thought it, I don't know what I thought, but I did not think it was an elephant. All right. Uh, anything else in here? Okay. Also, I don't hear any music. I can't reach the die until the wires are insulated. Why do I need a dice? Can I go outside? Wasn't there a way to get outside? No, I guess not. Okay. Yeah, buttons don't change direction. We went over this in the last part. The Goodyear blimp. Kind of random. Oh my god, somebody hijacked the airship. What? Hopefully he's running out of fuel. We'll just about hold out till he gets to the square. What? What? When was there an airship? Why is there a cop car on the lake? Did we do that? Fire extinguisher might come in handy. I don't remember putting the cop car on the lake. Dorian Brown, has the headless one caught him? What's happening in Raincliff? Every must, everything must have turned upside down. Um, I thought he was dead. That's why we're only looking for the other guy. Okay, that's... Tape. Okay. Oh, that's what we need the dice for. All right. That's it? That's the only thing in here? Isn't this to turn the wheel off? Am I imagining that? Oh wait, we do have nippers. I forgot. I certainly could use that there. <laughs> yes, yes, cute. Okay. So now I have insulating tape, which was to get the one dice. Look all the way back up here. That is really irritating. Okay, now I hear music. Okay, is there anything else here? Guess not. Is that the only dice we need? Yeah, I guess so. Weird. All right. It looks like we need more, but maybe not. Oh, it's this game again. Ooh, look, I can actually just move them. That's good. That will make my life much easier. Freeze me. Oh. No. It's way easier when you can just drag them. There we go. 
a hammer. I, I need to get the dude off the wheel, don't I? I need a way to wedge the wheel. Okay. That's not gonna work. How about a hammer? How about a pincer? Okay. I don't know what to do with that information. What do we need a hammer for? More pliers. I need a saw. Return to the palace hall square. Oops. Oh, right. I forgot. I, can, I need the motorcycle starter. A meteorological airship. Who knew there was one of those in Raincliff? It seems the headless one dragged the fuel into the palace hall to something or other. Wait. Stop. At the, wait. Who would have thought this must be the headless one's escape plan? The airship. Who would have thought there'd be one of those in Raincliff? I bet the headless... I can't read. Why is he going to do that? I mean, you could just leave. There's nobody else here. Besides me. I mean, I guess it's a good way to, like... The Headless One has vanished like a ghost, but I will find him. Okay. In order to activate the self-destruct system? Why would a blimp have a self-destruct system? Why wouldn't you just land it and poke a hole in it? Or just unmoor it and let it float away. Self-destruct system. Okay, now I have the motorcycle starter, but I don't want any of these guns. Because apparently, I don't. So I guess we're going to start the motorcycle for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. And now what? <laughs> we could have just climbed over the cart, but I guess we didn't want to. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, we broke the cart and we dropped all the boxes. I. Uh, I, I can't even. And then drama music! What is this? The headless one closed the hatch and hammered a wedge in the door. Well, you could... Why is this on fire? I just noticed that. I need some so something solid to... Well, I need an ex extinguisher. The crypt of some famous nobleman. I just stole the dude's head. Why did I do that? Face guard, helmet, lawn. Okay, you could just pick it up and look underneath it. It doesn't have a bottom. The axe is stuck. I guess, yeah. What if you lose it, though? Alright, let's go get the fire extinguisher, which I assume I'm going to use the at. Well, I don't know, actually. I don't know why I didn't just clip the handcuffs. I guess that goes there. No? Oh, it needs a crown. Okay. Sure, why not? So now I have an axe. Is that to break this? No. That can't be to get the handcuffs off, right? No, I didn't think so. What do I need an axe for? Oh, there's a branch over here. I don't know what I need the branch for, but... Yeah, I know, right? Uh, an oak branch. That's to stick in the wheel. Gotcha. Probably could use the axe, but that's fine. Wow, I carried that all the way over here? It didn't work either. Oh, it did work. Okay. All right. Dorian is a strong guy. He survived this heart. Looks like he's trying to give me something. Where are you going? Away. Sure, why not? Okay, so now we have the ball for the gate. 
Okay, bye! <laughs> Which is... Where's the gate? Oh, that was all the way back at their house. Dang it. Nope, downstairs. Nope, wrong way. There we go. This way. So this is this. Right? Okay. I need to get it there, I guess? What do I have to do? Use the arrows to rotate the lock plate. The ball on the surface of the lock should press the four steel balls. Alright, let's see if we can do this. I'm so bad at these. Oh, I can't go that way. Okay, one... This way. This way? Yes, okay. Loop. And then the other way. No, 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 I like how you can turn it even when it's moving. They don't- Stop that, for heaven's sakes. They don't usually let you do that. No, wrong way. Gosh darn it. There we go. All right. And that gave me a pin. Oh, it also opened part of the gate. Okay. Do I really want to open this giant door? Like, what's behind it? It is a cool door. But why do I want to open it? Also, what did I need a pin for? Two tigers? I don't think we need two tigers. What do I need a pin for? Oh, you think there's two tigers behind the door? That's adorable. There isn't anything else up here, is there? Except for the tiger. No, there's nothing else up here except for the tiger. There's nothing here. There's nothing there except the book. Uh, nope, that was finished. Okay, there's nothing in there. And there's nothing in here. Okay, so we're done upstairs. There's nothing in the garage. And the door is in here. So we need to finish the door. There's nothing here. Oh, we've got all this nonsense going on. I forgot about this. Uh, we need eyeglasses, or eyeglasses, eye protection and a long stick for that. We can't go any farther backwards. We need cement for the cement hand to pull the battery out of the toxic sewage. And that's where the hand is. We can't go do anything in here. He's dead. There's nothing there. There's nothing here. This we need a key card to self-destruct the blimp, which makes total sense. There's nothing at the gates. We cut the branch down. There's nothing by the owl. We need a crown for the skull. We need the fire extinguisher. For, oh, that's what we need the pin for. We need it to pick the lock on the handcuffs. Stop that. Thank you. Okay, now I can get the fire extinguisher. I don't understand what people in these games have against having fire extinguishing equipment easily accessible, but that is a theme. Why did he set part of the church on fire anyway? Oh, there's a crown. We need that. Nice! Um, you know he's the one that's running the, uh, science fiction contest, right? That- that's probably why. I mean, you could still do it. There's some good books. Not all of them, but some of them. You don't have to, I'm just saying. And you did do part of it. Nothing wrong with that. It was very helpful. But yeah, that's probably why he's following you. That looks like a ring, but that's a bracelet. There we go. 13, there's E equals MC squared again. I saw that in another one of these for no discernible reason. A broom. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Hugh Howie uh, is pretty cool. It looks like we actually have some decent books for the next task for the contest. You guys don't know what I'm talking about. There is a contest for the best science fiction self-published book and we are judging it and it's like half through by now i'll put a link to it it's pretty cool <laughs> i don't know he seems like a pretty cool dude where is an angel and a dart there's the angel 
Where's the dart? Oh, there's the dart. Wow, that's hidden pretty well. I thought that was a thermometer. Okay. Ta-da! And that is to open up the helmet, which is a very strange looking helmet. And it has a button for the elevator? Maybe? Yeah. It didn't actually bring me anywhere. It just gave me a triangle. Oh, that's for more of the big door. Okay. Which is all the way back here. This game would take so much less time if it had fast travel. Is that this? That's this one. Yep. Okay. Oh, poo on you, game. I don't want added gameplay. I want added interesting. At least it's not tilting the board. I think... Nope. I did that wrong. Nope. I'm dead already. Oh, I can hit the wall. Well, I didn't know that. Uh now I'm dead, because I'm stuck. No, oh, okay, I can go that way. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I gotta get up to that one. Um, Alright, let's try that again. Wait, is that where I want to be? Kinda. Kinda, sorta. What am I trying to accomplish? Click the- drive the ball into one of the holes. Okay, so it doesn't matter which hole. I just realized there was more than one. Da 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 da. Oh, yeah, so close. Yet so far. I'm back where I started. Do I get a prize? I'm done. Oh, you jerk. I was so close. Yeah, I don't know why we're opening this giant door thing. Like, that's not part of what we're trying to accomplish. Aren't we supposed to be, you know, like catching the dude? What does that have to do with opening the door? Or did I completely forget something about this? Which is possible. Ooh, clippers and a vacuum cleaner. I don't know why we need a vacuum cleaner. And I guess that's it. Okay. Okay. Good. Can I reach that with that? No. Alright. Uh, what do I need? That's just the door. What was the last thing I needed for the door? I forgot. I mean, it'll probably be obvious, but I need the battery. That was right. I need the battery. Okay. So I'm all done over here, except I need the battery. I'm all done in here, except I need the cement. There's nothing to do here. There's nothing to do here. I just need the hand. Right. Which I need the cement for, which I need a long stick for. Which I have not found anything to get the cement with, even though there's all kinds of... Oh, he's shooting at me with a machine gun that he has. The headless one is a professional killer! It's a miracle I managed to escape. Now I should find some protection to get to the palace. You should have taken a gun. Okay then. Um. Well, that gives me a lot less options, doesn't it? Yes, yes, he did. I mean, technically, machine guns are harder to um, aim with, but still, he probably should have gotten me, especially since it was a surprise attack. And he knew I would be coming out from that direction. There's nothing else down here, right? No, just the water. Okay. I'm confused. I don't need clippers. What is that called? I have no idea what that says. I wonder if that just didn't get translated. And that's vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner I got. 
Um, unless I wake up the tiger with the vacuum cleaner, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. Return to the crossroad and apport, approach the two lights on the right wall. Cut the loop on the ski pole. The crossroads? Backyard. Old kitchen. Crossroads. This is the crossroads. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay. That's fine. Now I can use this to get the cement. Which I can use to fix the arm, which I can use to get to the battery, which I can use to open the door. But I don't know why I need to open the door. And I have no idea what I'm going to use the vacuum cleaner for. All right. Well, let's go. We're going to clean up this town. <laughs> You're terrible. All right. I have no idea what's behind this door. I assume it's some sort of protection from gunshots. Is it a tank? Oh, I love this game. How many things was that? Not enough. Well, that's not going to work, is it? Uh, you know what? Press blue and red buttons to rotate the lamp because change the color of the sectors. Your task is to color the whole disc blue and color red after that? Oh, heck no! I'm not doing this more than once. Not a thing. The door is open! Here is the headless's room, but he's not in there. The room has changed into a prison cell. This must be the place the headless one escaped from. I mean, I guess, but why do we care? I should clean the corner with a vacuum cleaner? Yeah, I guess. You really think this place has power? Ooh, an axe. Yay, I get an axe. Okay, a riot shield. Why is that in his room? Why is any of this stuff in his room? There's grenades in his room! Why are there grenades in his room? Candy. <laughs> Candy kind of makes sense. Grenades and such, not so much. This was a prison cell. Why are there grenades in here? Why is there a bear trap in here? I guess. I, I, I don't understand. I am also not paying attention. Oh, there's the candy. I, I, I don't get it. I, I don't get it at all. Right. There's a, pe a pelican. No, that's a flamingo. Good job, me. Where's the rooster? I thought I saw him. And a map. Yeah, they just like have a whole bunch of weapons in here. Bows and arrows. A gun. A machine gun at that. Why? How? Like, they obviously had to have put him in here with this stuff. Does it make any sense? Alright. Where's the ball? There it is. Riot shield. That makes total sense. Raphael Brown, or the Headless, as he calls himself, is the father of Morty, Dory, and Bella. That's what I figured. Unlike them, he is capable of returning to corporeal state, but he wishes to remain invisible. Raphael Brown always felt contempt and hatred towards people, which must be caused by subconscious fear of society. At some moment, this deep feeling grew into mania and his mental disorder developed. In other words, Raphael Brown is mad, invisible murderer. Obviously. Raphael is highly dangerous. Several times he succeeded in escaping the mansion where he was kept imprisoned. I wonder how. And then he made slaughter in various towns and villages. His children volunteered to undertake an obligation of guarding the mad father and holding him captive. At the same time, countless efforts of citizens to uncover their secret didn't help at all. Um... See, we should have known all this because we had the girl with us. Volume 2 of the Brown History. If my intuition is correct, this tells about the headless one. Good job, you. So, like, why didn't she tell us that? I will kill. Okay, just in general. The commemorative board of the headless one. He is a misanthrope. Wait, what did that say? Oh, I don't know. Villainous slaughter took place in whatever. He doesn't like his kids. 
All those miserable faces. They are like rats, disgusting rats who run here and there, poking their noses in others' businesses. I will teach them to revere the headless one. Wanted, dead, or alive. Headless one. Also, if the whole thing with the roses is they take away your memory, why not just stick the roses in here and then, like, erase his memory and then he wouldn't be a murderer anymore. My own children betrayed me. I will punish them. No one can keep me here. I am the angel of vengeance. I will strike from out of nowhere, leaving blood and memory in my wick. But, like, they could just keep him in there with the roses indefinitely, you know? Uh, I guess that's all I need here. And that's the key card. And that's a gun shield. So, they had him in a room with a whole bunch of weapons, and he escaped... And I had to go through the big door, even though he probably broke out that window. Now we're going to go blow up the blimp for some reason. Instead of just taking out the bad guy. Yeah, no, I got that, you dork. He's already up there. Why isn't he Wait, now let's let's start over again. Okay. We're here. He was on the roof. Right there. That's where he was shooting from. He is still up here or he's in the blimp. Why is he not shooting us? But then why isn't he stopping us is the better question. What is all this? Put every button in the right place in the right row. Use the hint on the magnet key. As soon as the panel is completely closed, the self-destruct system will be launched. Does that make any sense to you? Okay, so this is red skull, I guess, goes here. Okay, but what about all the other things? I assume this all has to be red. But what colors are in the other things? Wait, what just happened? Are those in the right place or the wrong place? I think those are in the right place. Yes, okay. All right, so now I just have to line... So this is the right color here. Got it, all right. Uh, here. So that one should be right now. Yes, okay. And this one is right, so the blue goes here. Wait, I didn't look. Uh, this one is right, so the teal goes over here. That was weird. Okay, so this one's right, so the yellow is in the last line. Okay. And then this one needs to be in order. Did he just push me off the roof? No, he just hit me with something. And now he's gonna shoot me. Or he's- I'm hanging off the roof. Wait! No, don't go in the blimp! Wait, what just happened? I'm confused. The headless one is inside the airship. Okay. He didn't notice that the self-destruct was going off. It was making a siren noise. Wait, no! Uh, that, that was the end? Okay. I, I, I skipped the credits because I thought I could go, like, investigate, but I guess he did! So, the end! I guess he wasn't very smart. Alright, so now we got the wallpapers. I don't know why this is a different season. Maybe they weren't sure what season they were going to do. There's the petals and the masks. There's the crypt. Yeah, there's nothing in here from that. Oh, so let's see. Concept art. That's good concept art. Hmm. Oh, they didn't actually have most of these people in here, did they? Whoever did the sketches was really good. 
Oh, I like that. That's cute. I guess. That's pretty cool. Huh. Interesting. Alright. I guess knowledge test? What secret society does the detective holding the investigation of Raincliff work for? Mystery trackers. Who did the detective meet in the streets? Masked phantoms. I mean, they're invisible people, but that's who he met. Oh, it's not going to let me guess again. When did the detective have to use explosives during the investigation? A bunch of times. Gasoline? No, we didn't do that. Dynamite to explode the gates. Grenade to explode the ice. Self-destruct? Yeah, we blew up three things. God, that's good for us. The name of the first invisible person in a mask the detective met in the street is... We met Dorian... No, Mortimer it was. Okay. Where did Mr. Toad, the loyal detective's assistant, come from? It was created by Professor Boyd. No, he was the famous delusionist. He's awesome. And I love him. What is the name of the bus driver? I have no idea. Not Ray Bradbury. <laughs> Fritz Labor. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. Those are uh, famous authors spelled wrong. Which of the students did Arabelle Brown fall in love with? Uh, wasn't it this dude? Yes, okay. Why do the Invisibles wear masks? That one. What is the real name of the headless invisible murderer? Raphael. That was my grandfather's name. Raphael. The history of the Brown family mansion is written by the city historian. No? Oh, the pharmacist. That's right. Why is it impossible for Morty, Dory, and Belle to leave the city? Probably that one. What is the name of Mortimer, Dorian, and Annabella's mother? That I don't remember. Is it Eleanor? No. Okay. How many frogs can be collected in the streets? Way more than 50. It was, I was still finding frogs way after I found them all. What mask did the Invisibles wear? No, we are not. I mean, it's been a while since we played the beginning of it, to be fair. Let's see. Uh, Dorian with the beak, Mortimer with the mime. No, I think... Dorian, no mask. No, they all had masks. Dorian's mime, Mortimer with the beak. Yeah. When was the Brown family mansion built? Probably 1914 or 1812. Okay. Where did the black roses come from? I thought they were blue. The roses were artificially bred. Um, the old brown brought the roses from the east. That one. You made a mistake. I know I made a mistake. I have to do it again? Alright, come on now. Invisible people. That's the grenade, the ice, yes. Which one, we, which one did we ask first? Mortimer, yeah. And Mr. Toad was the illusionist. It wasn't this. Fritz, okay. Uh, which of the students did Arabelle if that was him? Why didn't the visible run? This is basically ever had. Real names, free fuel. History was the pharmacist. Parsable for them to leave the city. Yes. Alright, this one I don't know. Angelina? Ooh, okay, good. How many frogs? Was it 60 or is it 55? Ah! Dang, nabbit. I have to do it again. Mr. Travis, this is a little grenade. Mortimer. Illusionist, Fritz. We can go on. I can say that. Spaces. I can't have them. Break your old pharmacist. Bobby Fritz, Lose, Angelina. Must be 60. I thought it was 50. And then I found extra. What's the masks? Okay, I got this one wrong, didn't I? No, I got this one right. That was this one. Yeah. And we got that one right. One of the last crusades. Congratulations! We have unlocked the epilogue! Okay. Oh, this is the epilogue. What happens next? City of Raincliffe. After the memorable events and the revelation of the case of the Invisibles, it didn't take long for Raincliffe to become inhabited again. The citizens return to the city and the windows are lit again. 
The Brown Mansion has been restored and included in the list of historical and architectural, architectural monuments. Mortimer Brown and Raphael Brown. Mortimer Brown is buried in the piece, that's the wrong kind of piece, in the piece of the backyard. Oh, I guess maybe it could be. Mortimer Brown is buried in the piece of the backyard of the old church of Raincliffe. His father Raphael's grave is placed next to him. Once a year, in the most freezing day of winter, a bunch of black roses appear at Mortimer's grave. The witnesses say the flowers show up from the air. Dorian Brown's fate is unknown. However, there are rumors that the secret order of mystery trackers invited a new agent. The new detective wears a dark glasses, a long leather coat, and a scarf to cover the face. The agent's surname is Brown. Okay, I promise. A. Jen Slotsky and Lisa Thompson. On the contrary, A. Jen and Lisa decided to dedicate their lives to solving secrets and mysteries. Enlisting the support from one of the traveling TV shows, they started their journalist career making reports from the most incredible parts of the world. I guess those were two of the college students. Fritz Lieber kept working as a university bus driver for years. Once in a while, he'd re recall over a beer the story of what happened to him in Raincliffe, but his friends never quite believed him. And there's a picture of him drunk and passed out. Lovely. Bob Crowd. After the events in Raincliffe, he dropped off from the university and became a professional motorcycle racer in one of the best world teams. Giving interviews, he mentioned more than once that the past experience made him look at the world in a new way and convinced him not to waste his life. Okay. Ingar Vasa and Arabelle Brown. After the escape from the city, Ingvar and Arabelle disappeared, hiding from fuss and reporters. They got married and traveled around the world a lot. They were last seen in the USA in a remote town of Montana. Their first son's name is Morty. Vasa and he likes turning invisible when taking an extra sweet... F Wait. Vasa and he likes turning invisible when taking extra sweet from the kitchen. That kind of makes sense. Detective and Mr. Toad. That's us. After closing the case of the Invisibles, the detective and Mr. Toad returned to the Order headquarters. A new case was waiting for them. A young TV journalist, Sarah Stapleton, had not returned from the Black Isle in the Atlantic Ocean. That was actually kind of cute. Oh, now we can watch the bonus video. Um... I guess they had fun making this video game. <laughs> painting. What is this? What is going on? Oh, cute. It's an advertisement for the next game. Did you see both of those? Did you, like, step out for a second? Because you need to see... No, you saw them. Okay, good. Okay. Oops, I pressed a button. Oh, no. No, 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 no. We want to be done. Okay. Yes, I agree. That was that was adorable. Kudos, guys. It may have been a very strange game, but it was very strange. Good job. <laughs> All right. Yes, we want to quit. Thank you. Right. So that was the second Mystery Trackers game. Now we have only been playing for an hour, so we can do the demo of the third Mystery Trackers game, which is Black Isles, like they just uh, advertised to us. Let's do the demo. Okay, let's go. And I will do the demo as a separate video though. So my name is Fate Touched and I will see you later. Bye.